I think Reese is nervous about tryouts. You ready? Okay, hey, bye guys. Good luck. Yeah. Yeah. I'm so proud of you today. You guys did amazing. I can't wait to find out the results tomorrow. Good job. Heyo. Welcome to today's video. Today is an exciting, exciting, exciting day. It's only 10.30 a.m. I just got out from the gym and we're gonna get Perry's hair done because today is, drum roll. Tryouts. And she's like excited and nervous all at the same time. I'm really scared. She's prepared herself really well for today. Why don't you tell everybody kind of what you're hoping for? Um, like what are you hoping for? What like what level? What what um, level teams? three and storm and four point two or storm voltage if they can't put me on storm four point two. Okay, so four point two is basically level two tumbling, and but it's level four, four skills like. Like stunting. Like stunting. So, so it's level four stunts, level two tumbling. Yeah, so she'll be able to fly level four um, if that's the team she makes. Um, and then if not, she'll do level three, which she that what she's hoping for anyway. Hoping to be on level three, oh, really? which would be voltage and storm. storm. She wants to cross compete again this year if there's room. So there's no guarantee. Like I was watching the parent meeting last night. We had a parent meeting on Zoom last night, and there is no guarantee that you can cross over. If there's room for you, they said absolutely, but. That's just what they said in the thing. So uh -oh. <laughs> she may not cross compete. And I know Reese has expressed some interest too, but it honestly depends if they have room for them. We're gonna do the braids. She wants her hair done. This is a certain way we did it and she loved it. So we're gonna do it again. It's just kind of like a fun high point. It was, it was cute, I liked it. When you put the color in too. But I was talking yes. to Reese and Perry this morning about it doesn't matter what team you make. So if you're back on level two, that doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't define who you are. Maybe it's like a good thing. It's, you know, yeah. one more year. Sometimes not getting what you want actually benefits you in the end. Honestly, the coaches are going to put you where they feel you'll have the most success. And that's what you have to remember. It's hard as it is. And you may be sad and upset for a little bit. At the end of the day, it's going to be best for you, you know? So you can't be upset if you don't make the team that you were hoping to make, you know? I'm scared. Even though I know it's going to be hard because you will, you'll feel sad. I mean, that's, that's natural. We all feel sad when we have a goal in mind. But I think at the end of the day, should, like at the end of the day, it's gonna be what's best for you. We figure out our results tomorrow night. Yes. I'm having a team sleepover yeah. with my last team, Infinity. Um, Cause it's our last time that we're all gonna be in like a team together, I think. Yeah. So we're having a sleepover. Isn't that kind of sad, tonight. you guys? But yeah. I think it's cool that her team, Infinity, like they've all stayed really tight and close and they just, cutest group of girls. And we're so sad there's a couple of them that aren't coming back next year. We're gonna do some fun braids on her hair. And we do actually outside braid hair, so this is cute. So we just do the top pieces. I'll kind of show you what we do. Here we go, I've got our little braid, and now I'm just gonna braid it. So if you guys look on the side here, it's not even like really a, like a part here. So to parry turn your head just a little bit like that. So I don't really have like a part, because I'm basically gonna pull this up into a ponytail, makes sense? So we're gonna braid this all the way down, because this is cute too, having the two braids kind of pop, like pop out of the ponytail when it's all curly, it's so cute. So I'm doing this and I'll do the exact same thing on the other side. Oh yeah, you guys, if you didn't know, Kesley is visiting Brock in Nashville for his birthday. In fact, his birthday is today. So she wants to make sure, Perry, that we call her today after she said, mom, make sure that Reese and Perry call me after their tryouts today to let me know how they did. Cause she's, Kesley's really wish she could have been here for that. Anyway, I told my girls the one thing, like I said to Reese this morning, I said, Reese, as long as you're enjoying the sport and you and Perry are loving cheer, that's all that matters to me. If you guys are not enjoying this and you're feeling overwhelmed for any reason, you come tell us because we want you to love what you do. And if you don't love it, I, I don't ever want it. you to, I know you love it. I think Reese is nervous about tryouts. She's kind of holding in a little bit of her um, anxiety. And so I just told her, I'm like, you know what? It's gonna be okay with whatever level you make. Everyone's nervous right now. I, can I think everybody's I nervous. I'm it's just, scared. The thing is, it's it, and it all works out in the end. And I just told Reese, I said, you know, as long as you enjoy it and you have a good time, that's all that matters to me. And yeah, you just gotta be happy. And if you don't, if you don't love it, please let me know. 
And she's like, no, mom, I, I love it so much. And I'm just finishing the other side now. And then we're gonna curl the ponytail. Yeah. This is what it looks like, and then this is the back, but it looks better when we curl it. We're yeah, it's curl so it. cute when it's, it's so curly. Cute. So this is the final. I just curled it in the back, and then we rattled it just a little. And that is what it looks like. That's how she wanted it today. So it's kind of fun. Anyway, okay, she's gonna get ready for cheer. Yep. Okay, I also did Reese's hair. Look how cute. It's got her cute shorts on. Her sports bra, we're ready to go. And, and Perry's wearing her rival gear. She's like, I wanna wear my rival gear. Some of my friends are wearing them. So she's like, I wanna wear it too. I'm like, all right, you do that. You ready? Yeah. Okay, as we're getting ready to leave, <laughs> this one was outside while Rhett's mowing the lawn. <laughs> and look, look at these paws. She's been in heaven out here. And this one's been out here too, but she doesn't get in the dirt like this one does. The rat's gonna give her a bath because we're gonna leave to go take Perry and Reese, but you are such a dirty little thing. You have fun, okay? His rival has recently moved to a new location and this is their new gym and it's so nice. It's a lot bigger and look at my cracked windshield. <laughs> but anyway, this is where it's all going down today. Lots of kids are here already. Guys, look who it is. It's Lainey. Can they hide the girls? Like her? Oh, yeah. We're at Travis right now. Hey, Amir, let's go explore. Say hi, Reese. Hey. Hi, say hi, Sam. Hey, everybody. My name's Sam. I am the cheerleader of the cheerleaders. <laughs> yeah, he's pretty good. He's better than me. Okay, these girls are all ready to go. They're getting nervous. Okay, bye guys. Good luck. Okay, bye Reese. Love you. She did it. She did it. Reese, I'm so happy for you. Oh, Perry, you did good. I'm so proud of you guys. Over, and these girls did amazing. In fact, they're texting or calling Kesley since she's not here and she wants to hear how they did. Hi, we finished tryouts. I know, I, or I was actually waiting for you to call me. Guess what? Thank you. Reese threw every single tuck, and I did every single tuck, and then we both did standing aerial for all of our aerials. And I think we're gonna make it. <laughs> Isn't that so cool? Kesley, aren't you so proud of Reese? I'm so proud. That's awesome. She did so good. Are you having fun with Brock? Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, I just, I just gave him his gifts for his birthday. So. Oh, that's so fun. I'll call you after, uh, after we get the results. Okay, well, good job. Okay. Love you. Yeah, love you. Okay. Bye. Bye. We're gonna go get Starbucks. These girls were dying. They asked me if we can get Starbucks after the comp or after competition, after tryouts. This is the one. This is the one time I couldn't say no. <laughs> Dad's like, yeah, let's go get yeah, you one. Yeah, we'll get you one. So we're gonna get him a Starbucks. But Reese, do you wanna do you wanna tell everybody why we're so excited about why you threw your tuck? Why this is a big deal? We haven't mentioned anything to our viewers about this, and so yeah, yeah. So I've been having this mental block, kind of. For like a couple of days. For like a couple of days. We, we don't like to call it a mental block. Yeah. That's what they refer to it as in the cheer world, but we don't like to call it a mental block. Right. Because it's just, yeah. it, it just you know, it's just something, more experience, more practice, more confidence, we'll fix it. Right. And I finally, well like, I threw it. But like, Everything today. And the coaches were so excited because the last couple of days that she was at clinic, she couldn't throw them. Like she got scared, like she'd like bail out last second and she actually fell. At first she did a walk over and up hand playing tuck. Uh -huh. And um, they like loved it so much. And then like towards the end, they're like, can you do a round up hand playing tuck one more time? 
and she was saying like, look, her tongue is like. That's what they were saying. The, the tuck was so high that all the coaches were like, whoa. I know. <laughs> you guys did that awesome. That was all my test. I was like so nervous. I could tell. I could tell all morning um, yes, that you were very nervous. Was and I was like, yeah. She she was really quiet this morning. I could tell she was nervous, but I am I'm so proud of you both. And you, you guys did amazing. Quiet, so if I'm quiet, I'm nervous. Yeah, she was nervous, and she, that's her way of coping with it. I know, but when we first did like we were tumbling, like when we were about to go onto the mat tumble, we were shaking so much, and after we started tumbling, I was like my legs were like my legs started shaking. <laughs> you guys were that scary. nervous. I was scared to well, mess me We're up. so proud of you. I can't wait to find out the results to see where you are placed. And remember, whatever happens is for a reason, okay? So, whatever team you go on, it's meant to be. Okay? We're proud of you both. Okay, let's go get our Starbies. Okay, so we came to Target after we got home and then we ran into Natalie and Hudson and look they're looking at pajamas. I did my they're getting one for the Me too. Oh, yeah, so we're, they're getting right. matching pajamas Natalie, for their sleepover tonight. Which should be so fun. And they found these almost kind of like feel like a little silky yeah. material. Okay, tonight for the sleepover the girls have to bring a treat too and we got Oreos to share with the group and they're going to grab some other stuff. What else do you guys want to grab? Twizzlers. Oh yeah, Twizzlers are good. Twizzlers are always good. Yes, those are yummy. I love Twizzlers. Yum, yum. Okay, these girls are home. They're all packed up, ready to go. In fact, you know, as you guys know, it was an infinity party, but it kind of turned into a rival party. So all, a lot of girls from Reese's team are going tonight too. And so they're all gonna go and hang out and have a good time. Another mom's driving them up tonight and then we, we will be picking them up tomorrow. Oh, the Cause we are, Corey and I are going to Red Soccer so game right now. Some, you just know Oreos? Mm-hmm. Okay. We got some. Twizzlers. Twizzlers. Which I really want to eat by now. No, Swedish fish. And Starburst. Starburst. All pink. And then they have their new pajamas in there. So that will be fun. You guys and I'll have matching pajamas. And you guys have fun tonight. I'm so proud of you today. You guys did amazing. I can't wait to find out the results tomorrow. You guys just go and enjoy yourselves and have so much fun with your friends tonight. Okay. Okay. Get a drop, get a drop. behind her chairs in the shade making sure that she's nice and cooled off and this one's just wanting to chase the ball so bad <laughs> Corey has the leash wrapped around his hand like <laughs> 10 times he's like please can I go I really want to go can I please dad <laughs> Nice job. 
Okay, so we just finished Rhett's game, and first of all, I wanna tell you something really cool, because Rhett's season was an undefeated season. Yep. They've won every single game, and that's not common, which so it's pretty cool, it's very rare. So congrats to you, Rhett, and your team. First place on your season, and Rhett scored the goal that put him tied 2-2. And he almost had the next goal. Yeah. And then After almost that. had the fourth goal. Yeah, almost. Yeah, he, only, he could have had three goals today. Yeah, three goals. He was so close. Those other ones were so close. Brett, you mm -hmm. did amazing today. It was so neat.